It's Domino's. Inspired by a sale of used hospital mattresses, it's the thriller second game where contestants have to risk life and limb, but especially life, as they cross a row of upturned dominoes. Actually, you know, I'm kidding about the danger because this has been signed off by the health and safety officer. Actually, I'm, I'm kidding again. There is no health and safety officer. So, are you ready? Player one. Let's meet him. It's Chai. I think he was born ready. This is a moment to cherish and remember. The first ever player of dominoes. And Chai goes down in history. Way, way down. All the way down to the ground, in fact. If Chai was the Neil Armstrong of dominoes, then coming up next is the Buzz Aldrin. Meet Pon. The general's giving him a few tips here, like keep your mouth shut or you'll knock your teeth out. Pon thinks he's kidding. But we know he is not kidding. Pon prepares for this exciting challenge, stroke ridiculously stupid risk. And off he goes, and he fails as well. But the good news is, he lives to tell the tale. And so we come to a familiar scene, the general chatting up a contestant. You know, it's not his fault. There's no off position on the charm switch. You show him a pretty face in a crash helmet and wearing a safety jacket, and he turns into George Clooney. That was a long build-up. Let's hope it was worth the wait. Ah, it wasn't. And another one of the general's dates ends badly. No flirting with this contestant, obviously. They're even making the course more difficult for him. Oh, but it doesn't seem to cause him any problems. This was probably one of the greatest performances of Domino you will ever see. One of the greatest things I've ever seen. And I've seen Cats the Musical twice. Jesus may have walked on water, but even he would admit that he's been toppled by this guy walking on upturned mattresses. Your move, Jesus. Next, it's Arm. Now, how will she follow that miraculous performance? Ooh, with a magnificent five-star faceplant. That's pretty good. 